Hello everyone, welcome back to Apple Bay. Um, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to put the strip on the iMac, how to center the screen properly, as sometimes they go like a little bit left or a little bit right, and how to seal the machine properly, making sure you can open again if you have to do it again, you know, like if you have to replace the hard drive or whatever you have to do. I'll show you how to do it on a very, very easy step. So let's start it. Okay. okay. First of all, we need to remove all the tapes around so everything is clean and ready to go secondly make sure you use the right tape don't use those cheap rubbish from eBay find a supplier who can give you a, a, a decent quality these are a replacement they are not Apple but they can split in between the both tape otherwise if you buy those one from Apple from sorry from eBay or you know cheap website you're going to break the screen once you try to open it again. So this is the way I like to do it. I'm not saying it's the right or the wrong way, but that works for me every time. So you got one, one side and the other side. So this goes that way. Yep. So remove the back one, place on the hole they got tiny holes yeah keep it straight pull the back keep it straight and that's it next one you can do in any order doesn't have to be in the order I'm doing it again you got a tiny hole uh, let me see if I can focus that hole it's the same here so you just match if you if you are not really able to do it take a pen take, take something put through the hole put on the hole there stick a little bit yeah that will do make sure it's straight pull the bottom do not and uh, stick yet so until you kind of like straight then you push down right so so far so good just carry on do it with the other tapes same thing same thing Straight, pull the bottom, straight in line, gentle push with your finger. Right, the bottom is slightly more difficult because if you go over the edges, then it's going to be a problem to, to put the screen. So, how we do it? We take it completely. Yeah, and you hold one end and the other end. This end go all the way close to the edge, stick a little bit. And this one kind of like pull up and down, then go straight. This tape is for the newest model. It's for the 2019 model. Uh, that they do, they do have the the, the microphone. You, the, this model, the microphone is on the on the top. The 2017, I believe, and the 2019, the microphone is located on the bottom. So this strip have a little cut on there. Uh, probably you can see that for the microphone. However, they work fine on this model. It's, it's not a big deal. Okay. Let's do the last one. Same again. 
all the way to the edge there stick a little bit so you got something to grab then probably halfway through push in gentle there and the last bit push there and we're done don't remove any tape yet just leave it as it is now is the tricky bit so take a packing tape maybe around 30 centimeters or six inch i believe so i'm not really good in inches and place in the bottom okay bend this one Then you grab your screen that I think I forgot to clean it. Not very good. So make sure you clean your tape edges. I forgot. Nice. Right. So this video is going to take slightly longer than I was planning today. Mm -mm -mm. Peel it off. Peel it off. Don't worry about the residual glue is on there. Don't, don't, doesn't matter. Just leave it. Make sure all the edges are clean. And be really careful with your screen. Do not chip it. It's very expensive. In UK, this 5k screen they are about 420 to 480 pound on ebay so i assume the main dealer will charge maybe 650 pound to fix it um all we know this this repair are not cheap so really really be careful if possible put something soft on the bottom to to hold the screen i've been doing this one for a long time so i'm quite confident doing this way Right. Screen is clean. So now, without removing any tape, let me move a little bit of camera. Sorry about this one. There we go. So, without removing anything, this is the tape. The, the, just the cello tape. So, you put in there on the edge really nicely put on the other edge make sure make sure you you are 100 percent true on both edges once you're 100 percent true on both edges tape it yeah that's the trick tape it now you can tilt your screen yeah gentle tilt the screen yeah now you can Remove the sticker, just the bottom sticker, not the top one. Because you already center with the, the bottom tape, it will be easy to put in place. Yep, sit on the edge. Pull it up. It's a bit tricky now. Sorry, folks. It's because the angle of the camera. Yep, there we go. And then you put it back. You push that one. Make sure it's proper tape. Now, you can connect inside uh, because this is not coming out i'm just holding with one hand connecting my backlight connecting my ldvs cable or screen cable or lcd cable whatever way you want to call 
Yeah. And before, before pulling the other tags, I like to test the machine. I always test it, because otherwise you get wasting, wasting more tape, you know, the strips. So I'll make sure all the connections are fine. Machine switching on. This, I, I didn't test the machine. The machine, we have some replacement inside, inside going on. So come on, we waiting for a flashing folder. Or playing. Call. Hmm, nice. Backlog is on. Yeah, there we go. Flashing folder. So we do have a working machine. Now we can pull the, the tags and, and just close it back. Um, I'm not going to do it yet that because I may need to replace this hard drive, but this is the way you do it. So this way is true center on both sides. So you have the guy of the tape. If you're scared to do this on, on the table, you can probably do um, on a cushion um, table with, with, I don't know, some, some um, tower or, or something else. You can do flat. But this is a really good way to do it. So you always get center. Thank you very much and see you next time. Bye.